Hello everyone. Thank you for visiting my channel. My name is Young. Please subscribe to my channel to continue to make useful videos for you. Thank you for your help. Today's topic is how to measure bias, high voltage, I mean B plus, and low voltages for filament without opening the bottom cover. Last time I mentioned about the same topic with self-bias amplifier, but this time this is fixed bias amplifier. This amplifier model name is B-7V was designed by me and um, I love it very much. This time you need a fixed bias amplifier and digital multimeter. Cheap one like this, simple one, is okay because the input uh, resistance is very, very high, so it's okay. But um, I don't recommend you this kind of uh, analog multimeters can damage your amplifier while you are measuring bias voltage. So don't forget to use this kind of digital multimeter for today's topic. Before you turn on power, pull out power to first. Then turn the power on. Connect one of test lead to speaker ground terminal and connect another test read to number five. One, two, three, four, five. Then bias voltage is 21 volts. It's a little lower than uh, regular amplifiers. However, this value will be very helpful for stable amplification and long tube life. Okay, uh, this time let's measure plate and screen grid number two. Uh, octal socket pin numbering system from top view starts from here because this is pin guide. One, two, three. Three is plate. Let's see. Three hundred and fifty five volts now, and let's see screen grid number two. It's almost same as plate. Let's measure filament voltage one, two, pin number two, and Six, seven, eight, so seven. Six point six volts. It's a little higher value because one tube, one power tube, KT eighty eight, is pulled out. Did you enjoy my video? If you like it, if you don't like it, that's okay. But please leave a comment why you don't like it. I'll do my best to make another video for you. 
until you are satisfied. Thank you very much for watching.